Hey guys, it's Jenna and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're getting into the Christmas spirit. I don't know about y'all, but Thanksgiving is done, Halloween's done, and Christmas is here. And I'm going out like full spirit. I mean, we got the Christmas tree, we got the red lipstick, we got the red sweater. Um, I got this adorable snowman blanket. Like, you know, we're going all out here. But I do this video every year, and this is my Christmas wish list. Now, this year, I'm going to make a little spin on it. I am going to be incorporating some things from my list, but also just things that I think any teen or girl my age or even younger than me would just love to have on their list this year. So we're going to get right into it. I love you so, so, so much. Make sure to subscribe to join our fam, y'all, and give this video a big thumbs up if you like it and if you want more Christmas videos. Plus, I'm going to Hawaii with my squad this week. So... We're about to party it up, new videos. I mean, come on guys, subscribe, join the family. Five, four, did you do it? Okay, anyhow, I hope you did it. But we're gonna get right into it. I love y'all so much. Okay, boom. Okay y'all, so I kind of categorized things from like the smaller gifts, like least expensive, I mean, to the most expensive. And I just wanna say, I don't expect anything in this video. Christmas to me is not about the gifts, but you guys love these videos every year and you keep requesting them, so I don't wanna stop doing them for y'all because I know you love them. So, we're here to do it. We're gonna start off right now with our first item being fuzzy socks. Now, I'm just going to say that you can get anybody fuzzy socks. You can give a 9-year-old fuzzy socks. You can give a 90-year-old man fuzzy socks. And they will literally love it. Because who doesn't want warm feet? I don't know about you, but fuzzy socks are the best. And they're definitely on my list this year. And the cool thing is there's so many different types of fuzzy socks. They're like aloe vera socks. Have you guys seen those? They like moisturize your feet. I know kind of crazy okay nobody gets people board games for christmas and that just shocks me they're awesome to play with fam with fam <laughs> with your family with your friends they're just so easy and i don't know like something about them just brings so much joy to me and one of the board games that are on my christmas list this year is this game called telestrations i played it at my friend's house and it was hilariously funny and i don't know I just want it and I want to play it with my fam and my friends. I don't know, it just seems so incredibly fun. But also there's so many different types of board games, so many options to choose from, and they're just so fun. Next thing I love to put on my Christmas list is just makeup products that I adore and that I need restocked. For example, for me, like I use this concealer, Nars Radiant Creamy Concealer, every day. I'm almost out of it, and if I restock it for Christmas, then I don't need a new one till a couple months. And it's just so easy. And it's something I'm going to use, and I know I'm going to use, and it just helps me out because I use it every day. Also, if you guys are wondering, some of my favorite makeup and skincare products, these are some of them. I love this Glossier Lash Lake Mascara, this Benefit Mascara. Uh, I love this Fenty Beauty highlighter. I think it's amazing. I'm wearing it right now. I don't know if you can see the glow, but she's there. <laughs> and I also love this moisturizer, Nurture Me Moisturizing Cream. It's on my list this year because I literally used a whole jar of it. I think I've gone through like two of these already because I'm obsessed with it and it smells amazing. And also for like palettes and stuff, you guys are wondering some of my faves. I love Tarte palettes. I really enjoy the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette also let's see what else Ooh, you know what palettes are good y'all Juvia's Place palettes those are really good I love those too next thing I don't know if you guys are religious or not but I am I have very strong faith and this year I would love to add to my devotional collection I read my devotionals every single night and I have three that I've already read like the full thing of, so I want to get a fourth to add in my collection. I don't know, it's just something that would be really great to have and something I would use, so yeah. Next thing is super popular and that is like Polaroid cameras, but in my opinion, I think it's better to just get like a Polaroid printer or an HP sprocket printer and you can just print photos from your phone. It's so much easier in my opinion. You can literally put them anywhere in your room. My room is filled with pictures and I just print it off from my phone using the HP sprocket. So since I have that, I would love more paper for it. I'm literally out y'all. Whenever I take pictures with my friends, I print them out and put them in my room. And now I'm sad because I can't print 
any photos out from Hawaii coming up because I know I'm going to take a lot. So I'm like, I need more film so I can print more photos because I think my strange addiction is photos. I know guys, it's really sad. I just admitted my deepest, darkest secret. I'm addicted to printing out photos and putting them on my wall. Next thing is jewelry. I don't know about y'all, but jewelry is something so sentimental to me. Like if somebody gets me jewelry, like I don't, I think I literally cry and it's just so sentimental and sweet. Like, okay, I don't know if I should tell you all this, but hopefully she's not watching this. But this year I'm getting my best friend like a necklace, just like the one I'm wearing. I really hope she's not watching it. But um, if she is, surprise. <laughs> but I think jewelry is so sweet and sentimental. Like if you have a girlfriend, boys, get your girlfriend a necklace. She will probably cry and love you forever. <laughs> For example, like this, here, this is my necklace. Oh, it's not really focusing, but it's really pretty. It's just my name, no, it's not my name, it's my initial. I adore it, I wear it every day, I'd never take it off. And it's by the company called Lena Bell. She is um, one of my family friends, she's amazing. So just a shout out to her, I'll put some of her um, necklaces up on the screen, they're absolutely gorgeous and she's so talented. Sweatpants, that is a great gift to get anybody, unless you don't know their size, that's a little complicated, but sweatpants are so good. I'm wearing sweatpants right now. My favorite sweats are probably from Brandy Melville and Hollister. I think they have great sweats for teens and tweens and stuff, so I love myself a good pair of sweats. I'm sure you will too, so get yourself a pair of sweats. Treat yourself. Insert Piper song. I'm gonna treat myself, treat myself, treat myself. I'm proud of my little sis, so. Next are pajamas, along with the comfy vibes. I just love being comfortable, and pajamas, again, you can never go wrong with. For example, these are on my list this year, if you're wondering. They're these Hollister ones, and they're stinking cute. They're so adorable, and I just love plaid. They're just so cute, so. Here's a few other pajamas that I think are so cute. I love Hollister pajamas, garage pajamas, um, airy pajamas. I mean, pretty much pajamas from anywhere. You could never go wrong. So I saw this corduroy jacket and I was literally obsessed with it. It's so cute. I think denim jackets, corduroy jackets, hoodies, they're just so in and they're so cute and they're so comfortable. So this corduroy jacket is definitely on my list, but I just want to show you guys some other hoodies and denim jackets that I think you guys would really love. Like, look at all these. Um, yeah, they're really cute. Okay, so I just want to mention these beauties. Um, these are Drip Creations. Drip is one of my favorite shoe companies. They turn, like, basic shoes like Air Force Ones, Vans, into, like, beautiful creations that they hand design. I don't know if you guys saw but that was a sunflower painted on my shoes. And they do a bunch of other designs. I'll put the other ones on the screen. They do like Powerpuff Girls, they do Billie Eilish designs, they do waves, like lightning bolts, butterflies, like they literally have everything. And I think they're having like a Black Friday sale or something. So go check that out. I'm obsessed with their shoes and you'll be really styled. Like, people will be asking you, like, all the time where you get your shoes from. Like, that happens to me all the time. Like, I have those, and I get stopped everywhere. And everyone's like, where do you get those? I've seen makeup fridges everywhere. And I'm just like, wow. Do I need this? No. Do I think it's incredibly cute and might be beneficial? Yes. Do I know? No. But do I want one? I think I do, y'all. Like, look at these little skincare fridges. Let me know what y'all think. So, I've seen these on my Instagram, and I think my friend Jaden has one. I don't know. I just think they look so cute. And I talked to, to the lady who does my facial. She's the best. Shout out to you, Haley. Anyways, um, she said that they were really beneficial, and they actually keep your products cold, which is really like good and beneficial for the skin. So I think I kind of want one this year. Is that bad? Like, is it kind of weird that I could just use my big old fridge and I just want to be like extra and 
get a little mini fridge probably okay guys the next couple of items are like very luxury items and again as i said in the beginning of the video i'm not expecting these things this is a wish list for a reason it's like things that'd be really cool to have so we're just gonna get into the luxury items First thing is this Louis Vuitton key pouch. Now, <laughs> I know, Louis Vuitton, I've never owned anything like high-end like that before, but this little key pouch looks so handy. I don't know if you all know, but I'm a driver. I got my permit and I think this would be really handy to put like my keys in and my cards and like insurance and driver license and all that boring stuff you have to have if you get stopped by a police or something, just mandatory things you need. I'm obsessed. It's like giving me like share vibes from Clueless. Ugh. I know a lot of my friends for Christmas, like they always have like the new phone on their list, which I think is really fun and cool. Uh, I have the iPhone XR, so I'm all set, but for all who want a new phone, if you guys have like a six or seven that's like dying off, maybe ask for a new phone or I don't know, maybe like a case. Ooh, cases are fun. Like I got this one from Wildflower. There's a bunch of different case websites too that are really adorable. That's a great gift to get somebody. And yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my Christmas wish list 2019 slash teen gift guide, guys. I hope you enjoyed and I'm just so grateful for you all. Thanksgiving just passed and I want to remind you how grateful I am for you. So thank you for sticking around to the end of this video. Make sure to subscribe before you leave though and I'll see you soon.